Hello and welcome to Here Tutoring. In this video, we're going to talk about how using your fingers will help you do better on the ACT science test. The ACT science passages require you to constantly go back and forth between the questions and the passage, which causes a lot of students to waste a lot of time because they lose track of what they're looking for or because they have trouble finding what they need to find. To help solve this problem, you should use your fingers to find and keep track of key pieces of information in each science passage. The reason why using your fingers is so effective is because your eyes naturally go to where you are pointing instead of wandering around trying to find what you're looking for and this will save you a lot of time searching around for the information you need. Using your fingers is a great strategy that I haven't really seen anyone else teach. So specifically, here's what you should do. Most of the questions for the data representation and research summary passages require you to refer to specific charts, tables, or trials. When you read each question, the first thing you should do is immediately look for which chart, table, or trial you need to refer to and put your left index finger by that chart, table, or trial. If the, request, if the question refers to more than one, use two or more of your fingers to keep track of which ones you need to focus on. While you do this, keep your right index finger at the question so you won't waste time trying to find the question you were originally at. So you'll be using both your hands to help your eyes find the information you need as quickly as possible. Next, find out what the question is asking and then move your eyes back to your left hand index finger which should already be at the table, chart, or trial you need to look at and figure out the answer as quickly as possible. Then repeat this process for each question. Since time is such a major issue for the ACT science test, it's important to make the most of every second you have and using your fingers to help you find and keep track of key information will save you a lot of valuable time for the test. In the next video, we'll talk more specifically about how to manage time between the seven passages for the ACT science test. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon.